Welcome to Sometime 2. Today we're working with page 61. Today's lesson is called Simple Equations. We're going to talk about division and multiplication. Just as subtraction and addition are opposites, so are multiplication and division. You see, 2 plus 1 equals 3. 1 plus 2 equals 3. But 3 minus 1 equals 2. 3 minus 2 equals 1. 2 times 3 equals 6. 3 times 2 equals 6. 6 divided by 3 equals 2. 6 divided by 2 equals 3. Let's see if we understand that. Let's try these. 4 times 3 equals 12. Or 3 times 4 equals 12. 12 divided by 3 equals 4. 12 divided by 4 equals 3. Let's try. 2 times 4 equals 8. 8 divided by 4 equals 2. 5 times 2 equals 10. 10 divided by 2 equals 5. You see, you can play games with these numbers. Look at this table. It will help you divide and multiply numbers. You go along the rows and you go down the columns. So let's look at the first row. Let's find number 6. Now if we want to multiply 6 by 2, we go down the column and we go along the row. So we go down number 6 and along row number 2 and we get 12. So 6 times 2, that's 12. Let's find 4 in the first row. If we want to multiply 4 by 3, we get 12. We go down the column and along the row. Look at number 2 in the first row. We go down the column until we find 12 and we get 6. So, this can mean 2 times 6 is 12. But it can also mean 12 divided by 6 is 2. Or 12 divided by 2 is 6. Do you get it? How about 3? Find number 3. Can you see the 12? Let's go down to 12. 4 times 3 is 12. It's a very useful column, isn't it? You can find 4 ways of making 12. 2 times 6, 3 times 4, 6 times 2, and 4 times 3. All of them make 12. Now let's see how many ways you can find to make 18. Can you find all the 18s? Well, there's 9 times 2. There's 6 times 3. There's 3 times 6. And there's 2 times 9. That's all we have time for today. Bye.